Hey, Melanie Beckler here, and in this video, we are going to look at the meaning of seeing your birthday. So anytime you keep seeing a certain sequence of numbers, it could be 1, 2, 3, 3, 3, 3, 4, 4, 4, 7, 8, 3, or the digits of your birthday, it can carry a deeper meaning and significance, and angels will indeed often use these number sequences to deliver a message. Because numbers are the mathematical language of the universe and carry a deep level of meaning. Higher spiritual beings are able to use numbers to get through to you, to catch your attention. And then with awareness, you can dive in, tune in, to what does seeing that number sequence mean? Above and beyond, oh, that's a cool coincidence. And above and beyond, recognizing that it's a sign that you have guides and angels with you. So in this video, we're specifically looking at seeing the numbers of your birthday. This could be seeing the month and day or seeing the year you were born. But essentially, when you see numbers and you realize, whoa, that's my birthday, this is what I'm talking about. So when that happens, when you realize you're seeing your birthday, the underlying message, significance, and meaning from the angels is that you are valued. It's a reminder of the unique, divine light expressed through you, through your individuality. Because your exact moment of birth is by no accident. It is by divine design. It is a part of the code of who you are. And when you look in to the numbers of your birthday, there is an incredible amount of information about your personality, about your soul destiny, about your dreams, even about your challenges, struggles and obstacles you may encounter on your path. You can learn about that level of what your birthday means through a numerology reading, through understanding your personal birthday numerology. Go to yourangelnumbers.com for a free numerology reading, and I will link to that in the description below. So there's an incredible amount of information about you stored in the numbers of your birthday. So when you see those numbers, it's the angels drawing your awareness to your unique strengths and qualities. So this may come up for you if you've been focused on trying to be like someone else, trying to model the path of another, the angels may remind you, hey, you are a unique divine being incarnate in physical form. You are here for a unique purpose and a unique mission. You are here to shine divine light through you in a way that's unlike anyone else. So don't try to follow in the footsteps of another. Don't try to dim or change your light to be like someone else. Rather, reconnect through clearing your mind and opening your heart and tuning in to your intuition, to who you really are, the truth of you. When you peel back the layers of conditioning, peel back the masks you've worn to try to fit in, beneath the surface of that is the core truth of you and why you're really here. Seeing your birthday numbers also reminds you that you have a unique purpose and mission and that it's time to reconnect with that, to realign with the authenticity and truth of who you really are and let that be expressed through you. To ask yourself, how can I be of service in the world in a way that I love and enjoy that also benefits others? When you ask yourself this, it is a helpful question or prompting you could journal about it to get clear about your life purpose, about why you're really here, remembering that ultimately your life purpose unfolds over a lifetime. It's not one thing, but there is often a tone or theme which you can uncover by going within through meditation, through paying attention to what you love and enjoy, what you're drawn to, what lights you up and excites you. Seeing the numbers of your birthday is the reminder to return to the core truth of you, to live your bliss, to live your divine individuality, and to remember that you are worthy of being here. 
You are enough, exactly who you are. And so let go of the negative self-talk, of the patterning, of the beliefs, of the fears and insecurities that say you are not enough. And remember that who you are at your core is exactly who you are meant to be and is needed in the world. So shine your light, reconnect with your truth, and take steps to anchor your intuition and inspirations into the world through inspired action because this is how you accomplish your purpose. This is how you embody more of the truth of the divine being you authentically are, which is what you're being called to do when you keep seeing the numbers of your birthday. Finally, there is so much more information about you that can be revealed in your personal numerology. Get your free numerology reading at yourangelnumbers.com. You are going to love reconnecting with the core traits and strengths and attributes of your individuality. And that numerology reading can be a powerful way to reconnect recenter in who you authentically are, so then you can begin to take inspired action steps to anchor your highest light into the world through action, through being of service, in a way you love and enjoy to live your most vibrant life. Because that's what seeing your birthday numbers are all about. It's about you embodying the divine truth of who you are unapologetically, shining your light and living your truth because that is exactly what the world needs, is for you to come alive, for you to shine your light, because when we all do that as individuals, when we all connect with the truth of our inner divine beingness and shine our individual light of love, the vibration of the world raises as a result. So shine your light, live your truth, and know that living the truth of you is the most beautiful thing you can do. It is the highest purpose for your life, embodying the fullness of your light and letting it shine through, anchoring it through your actions in the moment here and now. So I hope that this is helpful for you. Again, check out yourangelnumbers.com for your free numerology reading. And then if you would like to learn more about seeing angel numbers, be sure to comment below. Let me know what angel numbers you see most often, whether it is your birthday or is it a number like 1111 or 333 or 444 or 1234. Comment below and let me know. Then give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe here on YouTube if you've not already done that. And then I will see you in the next video. Bye for now.